Hi folks, welcome back to my channel. This is a six watt flex energy mini solar panel. Um, I have a couple solar panels. I have a 30 watt solar panel and a 60 watt solar panel, but I wanted to start off uh, with a smaller panel because it's the cheapest one um, that you can get. You can get this um, on Amazon for less than $20. Right now it's around 17. The reason that I wanted to uh, review this solar panel first was because this is the cheapest option um, that I've found. And most people think that solar energy is only for rich people and it's not affordable. But I mean, this proves that it is. You, if you're gonna be using this with, you know, iPhone or iPad, you don't wanna connect it directly. Um, into the solar panel. I mean, you can do that and you will charge it some, but it would be more uh, efficient if you plugged it into a power bank and then use the power bank to charge your device. If you do it directly, it'll, if there's a cloud, it'll stop it and then reset it and it'll just, will not charge quickly that way. So here I have a USB cable. Um, this is USB and USB-C um, because my power bank uh, takes USB-C. So you would just, you know, plug in the power bank, set the solar panel in the sun, plug in, and you're good to go. And then when that's charged, you can just plug your cell phone or other device easily. So the website uh, says that it's a six watt solar panel. Um, on the box, for what it's worth, it actually says that it is a uh, six and a half mini solar panel. And obviously for this price made in China. Um, and it produces five volts. And uh, what's good about it is it only weighs half a pound. Um, one thing you want to be careful with is the back, because if this cord goes, breaks in any way, of course you're done, you throw it away. Okay, now I'll cut to a video of me using the solar panel outside. Getting four watts, six watt solar panel. Getting four watts. So in that video, I was able to uh, get four watts um, from the solar panel uh, using a USB A to USB C to my Jackery three hundred. Um, that's the most I've gotten is four watts. I'm sure you can probably get five or six watts. Uh, I did it in the morning and it was, you know, you never know with the six watts, that's the most you'll ever get with any solar panel. So you can't assume that you're gonna get that. You may never get the highest amount. Overall, I would recommend uh, getting this, of course. Um, if you don't have any solar panels, you don't know anything about solar energy at all, this would just be a good experiment for cheap. You could get this for, you know, $17 and then buy a power bank for another $20 and then you're good. You've got a good setup for when the power goes out, you're always gonna be able to recharge your phone. This video isn't sponsored um, by the company in any way. Um, I just think it's a good affordable product. Um, so if you're gonna be camping, um, this would be a great way to keep your phone charged. Um, and compared to like Goal Zero, this is a lot cheaper than that. I'm sure it's not as, I mean, I know that it won't, it's not heavy duty, it won't hold up as well as Goal Zero, but for the price, I mean, this is a lot less. The Goal Zero five watt solar panel is like $60. And that'll be the end of the video, folks. Have a good one.